Here is the strain counter strain release positions to clear out the anterior thoracic tender points. Use this video after you have watched the anterior thoracic body scan and identified your unique tender points. Everybody's position will be a little bit different. Find the position which is most comfortable and which makes the tenderness disappear. I will demonstrate three positions you can use. For the upper thoracic tender points on the midline of the sternum, for the middle thoracic tender points on the abdomen above the navel, and for the lower thoracic tender points located on the abdomen below the navel and also at the top of the hip. To release the tender points located on the midline of the sternum, you'll want to sit comfortably, locate the point which is most tender, hold your finger on that point as though glued to it but with no pressure on it whatsoever. Next, drop your head forward and slouch slightly. Slouch all the way forward and then move about halfway back and poke in on that point again and see if it is still tender. If it's no longer tender, then stay in that position for 90 seconds. If it is still tender, then adjust the position slightly and check again. Continue adjusting the position and rechecking until you find a position where tenderness is at least 70% gone. If you have trouble finding the release position, go back to your original upright position and then slouch forward very, very slightly. It may be that only the tiniest amount of slouch is all that is needed to release the point. To release the tender points located on your upper abdomen between your navel and ribs involves a slight twist and bend to one side. Sit on a chair and place a small pillow under your hip on the same side as the tender point. This creates an uneven surface you're sitting on which bends your back slightly to the side of that tender point. Now locate the tender point using the opposite side hand. So for example if your tender point is located on the left side use one finger from your right hand to locate that point. As with all other points you want to poke into the area to locate it but then take all of the pressure off and just stick to it as though your finger were glued to the spot. Next, with your free hand, reach across to the opposite leg. As you'll see here, my left hand is reaching across to my right thigh. This gives a slight rotation. You can increase the amount of rotation by turning your head to the side and looking down at your side. Once you are in this position, poke on that tender point. If it is no longer tender, then stay in that position for 90 seconds. If it is still tender, play around with the amount of side bending or the amount of twisting. There will be a certain combination of these two which make the area soften and all of the tenderness go away. When you find that position which gets rid of the tenderness, stay in that position for 90 seconds. The lower abdomen tender points are located on the abdomen below the navel. There is also one on the top of your hip bone. Start by lying down on your back and place a pillow under your hips. Next, locate the tender point using the opposite side hand. So for example, if your tender point is located on the right side, use one finger from your left hand to locate that point. Locate the point and then stick to it without poking on it. Now, bring your knees up and slightly towards the same side of that tender point. When you find an easy position, poke on that point again and see if it is still tender. If tenderness is gone, stay in that position for 90 seconds. If tenderness is still present, move your legs into a slightly different position and try again there will be a certain position which makes the tenderness disappear.